Yeah, it is my uh, first World Cup distance win, and <laughs> I don't know, I'm really surprised. My body felt super good today. Skis were good, and I'm just, uh, I've been feeling very confident. I knew I had a very good sprint finish after Moscow in uh, two days ago. Uh, I was third there, but uh, I knew compared to some distance racers, if I was in good position, I had a good chance to um, to be up there in the race, and I'm, I'm thrilled and <laughs> I'm shocked actually, but uh, feel very, very happy. Yes, the course is different uh, since the last time I was here a few years ago. Um, it plays into my strengths because it just makes the sprint finish a little bit longer, uh, more flats before the finish line, and for me that's good because these two guys here and a lot of other guys in the field are a lot stronger climbers than I am, so <laughs> I'm super happy with the new course. I'm not actually thinking too, too much about the overall uh, World Cup right now. I mean, Dario has the thing pretty much locked up already and it's only February. <laughs> but uh, I was, uh, you know, Justin, our, our coach, and Alex, Ivan, and I, the three athletes here from Canada, we had a meeting yesterday and we decided if we were in good position for the for the intermediate sprints on lap three and five to, to might as well try and hold our position and get some points. But um, it, it worked out for, for me and for Alex and I to take some points on both laps. We just happened to be close to the front, but it was not a strategy today at all for me to go for any points. I just wanted, I guess on the fifth one, I felt really good and Alexander attacked a bit, so I decided to try and go with him, but he was too strong. <laughs> it absolutely helps to have strong teammates. I'm very lucky. Uh, our Canadian team has gotten better and better every year, and uh, Ivan is so thrilled to race here because he's from Sindhikar. I'm probably saying that wrong, but he's from Russia originally, but now he's now he's Canadian, so we're happy to have him. And, and uh, Alex, of course, is a phenomenal racer. I mean, he's going to be the future of skiing in Canada for sure. His dad was the man too, so uh, it, it really helps to have a strong team and we're all really good friends, and I think that's that helps us get results like today because when one person wins, it's the whole team that wins and we all celebrate it. So yeah, I'm super, super lucky. Proud to be Canadian for sure. Yes, of course, I'm really happy this race. It's really good for the second place. I was for them in this year. And the track is a bit different in this year. And yesterday when I saw it, I think maybe our organization special change the track for Devon. And then for me, it was only one tactic. I got back in the last tactic and then we'll be coming to me. Last year it uh, was a little bit shorter, it was 20 k and 30 and the weather was uh, warmer. I remember when it was 2 degrees and it was minus 15. And, uh, but maybe tomorrow it will be finished like in uh, last year and again fighting for maybe not for Devon. <laughs> Yeah, I, I was looking for the podium today because uh, I like uh, ribbons. I had here many good races. I think I had five starts and now four podiums, so uh, I like it. And uh, it's nice to be here. Um, so uh, I'm happy. The last two weeks I had trained a lot in, in Rupolding in my home area and it's the same uh, last 500 meters uh, like the old uh, ribbons course. So uh, I thought I have the old track, but the, uh, the new one is, is really good too. And uh, I think it's, it's good for the spectators and for the crowd that uh, you have more time in the stadium, um, that they can uh, yeah, see the athletes. And so it's, I think, more uh, action in the stadium. Yeah, in the beginning of the week, uh, the temperatures, uh, the weather forecast was really bad for ribbons um, because of uh, cold temperatures. So, um, our team decided not to go to, to Ribbons and uh, one day later the weather forecast looked a little bit better and uh, we athletes, we wanted to go, so um, in the end um, it was the right decision to come to Ribbons and to ski the races because I think uh, yeah, it's great to be here and the temperatures are now okay so everything is fine. <laughs>